Southampton under-18s narrowly lost out to Tottenham Hotspur this morning as Southampton went in search of their fifth win in the Barclays under-18 Premier League. Craig Fleming made four changes to the side which lost out to league leaders Chelsea last week. Harry Lewis makes his sixth appearance of the campaign in goal. Ben Cole and Alfie Jones come into the Saints' defence alongside Ollie Cook and Richard Bakary. Wilkin and O'Connor are joined in the middle of the park by last week's stoppage time goalscorer Joe Lee. And up front, Jan Valerie is given an attacking role on the right wing alongside Tyreek Johnson and captain Olafella Olamola. It was Southampton who took an early lead with barely 10 minutes on the clock. Tyreek Johnson tricked his way past Spurs left back Charlie Hayford and his cross was pounced on by Joe Lee in the box who calmly dinged the ball over the Spurs keeper to give Saints a 1-0 lead. With Ola Moller off injured in the 20th minute, substitute Harley Willard almost made an immediate impact, but unfortunately he couldn't reach Richard Bakary's cross. Jan Valerie started in a more attacking role this morning and looked a constant threat, doing well to get past Tasula, but his shot was easily saved. The Saints were putting in a dominant performance, showing great strength to perform like this after last week's result. Alfie Jones cleared the ball out and a silky flick from Johnson sent Valerie away down the right. Spurs tried to scramble his cross away, but only to Johnson who saw his shots blocked by a Spurs defence, throwing everything on the line to keep the ball from goal. Valerie and Johnson were again involved moments later, Valerie playing an inch-perfect ball in behind the Spurs defence, Johnson getting through one-on-one -on -one with McDermott in the box, but saw a fantastic double save from McDermott to keep him out. With seven minutes left in the first half, Southampton were looking clear favourites. Tottenham winger Jack Rolls unfortunate slip gave the ball to Wilkin, who played in Johnson, but an on-rushing McDermott scrambled the ball out to clear. That was perhaps the turning point that Spurs needed, and Tottenham soon started to turn up the tempo. Sarula's quick feet got him past Valerie at the back, and Sterling's header bounced back off the post. It was two quick goals which unfortunately cost the Saints. Sarula's quick feet meant they could get his cross in, and an unfortunate header from Ben Cole meant the Spurs had their equaliser. And less than a minute later, Sarula gave Spurs the lead. Sterling broke through the Saints' defence and played a neat pass into the left back, who finished well into the top right hand corner of the net and gave Spurs a 2 1 lead going into the break. The second half was one of much fewer chances. Rolls Cross found Sterling, whose header was saved by diving Harry Lewis. Saints came closest to an equaliser on the hour mark. Stuart Wilkins' corner was met by a rising Ollie Cook, but Spurs managed to keep his header out and their lead intact. Spurs kept their composure and nearly added a third. Substitute Aramidote tapped in what he thought was Spurs third, but it was ruled out for offside. Spurs' final chance came with a few minutes left. Charlie Owens battled well in midfield, setting up Ote, but Lewis was equal to it. Full time, Spurs 2, Saints 1.